Hello, my name is Ardi and we are going to solve problem 5.28 from Sadiku book. So, we are using an ideal of M here and we can use this following properties here. Remember, if we have an ideal of M, the voltage in the both terminals will be the same and the currents that goes in will be zero. And remember that op M is not a KCL node. Okay, that is the three properties of ideal op M. So we are asked to find I0 here. So maybe I just want this not here to be not B and this not here as not A. Okay, now this is our ground here and this is 0.4 from the ground. So this voltage here will be 0.4 and that means that because VA is equal that VB to VB, and that will be VA is equal to 0.4 volt. Okay, now we need to do KCL at node A. And KCL said that the sum of the currents that goes in is equal to the sum of the currents that goes out. So I want this to go in here. This I want to it to go out and this one I want it to go out. So this current here will be 0 minus VA. So I have 0 minus VA divided by 10 kilo. We just write it 10. And then this current here, it's going into the op amp. So that will be 0. So I will have 0 here and plus this current here finally we can just use ohm's law which is va minus vb divided by 50. okay now let's plug that 0.4 in so i'll have 0 minus 0.4 that will be minus 0.4 divided by 10 and that will equal to 0.4 minus VB divided by 50. Okay, maybe let's multiply both sides by 50. Okay, multiplying both sides by 50, we will get 10 with 50, we will cancel into 5. So I will have minus 2 here. And this one will be 0 0.4 minus VB. Or we can see that VB will be 0 0.4 plus 2 or 2.4 volt. Yeah, volt. That is VB, but the question is not asked about VB. The question is asked about I0. And I0, we can easily calculate this because we know VB. So we know VB minus 0 divided by 20 kilo ohm. That will be 2.4 divided by 20. And because this is volt and this is kilo ohm, the unit will be milliampere. So, but the value I will need to calculate it by calculator 2.4 divided by 20. That will be 0 0.12 milliampere. Or maybe I can just write it. I0 is 120 micro ampere. And that is all for this problem. So hopefully I did not make any mistakes in the calculation. And see you in the next video. Bye bye.